Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening with Mioix Fu. Just taking a second trying to... Oh yeah, we've got a broom. And the witch didn't want it. Just trying to remember where we were in the uh, item quest. I don't... I don't think I know anybody that we've met who needs a broom. Not yet, at least. Also, I think we're going the wrong way. It's been a while since I've recorded, so apologies are in order if I forget exactly where we're going. Have not been uh, the best with this Let's Play so far. Oh, could that... no, you're not allowed to do that. I was, I was above you. <laughs> oh. Man, I wish I had bow wow, take care of these things, no problem. Wonder if I could go back and get them. Hmm. Well, that's something I'll have to find out later. No, this is the way to the giant windfish egg. We want to go a little bit farther. Because we have another path that I neglected exploring. Can we do anything else up here? No, that's just that's just leading down into the mountain. <laughs> oh, I am never going to get tired of this hook shot. And if I do, well, then there's something wrong with me. Oh, <sighs> always gets me. I'm just not expecting it. Now, ah, whatever, I can take a couple of hearts. <laughs> Anyway, how is it going? I'm doing well. A little bit sick. So if I seem a little strange, a little bit loopy, well, now you know why. Not the usual kind of sick either, like uh, no cough, no real sneezes or anything like that, just kind of dizzy, kind of nauseous. So, it'll be fun. In fact, it's almost the same feeling that I get when I'm drunk. So it'll definitely be fun. <laughs> oh, it'll be fun indeed. All right, let's check out what's in here, because, well, I wanted to go check out what was in the, uh... What was the other way before we did? I mean, I know we've seen what's in this cave, but I mean, what's... Oh, can I get back? Yes, yes. Well, I took a hit from the bat. Whatever, whatever. Ooh. More badly translated hints. You are near the Eagle's Tower. Beware of the bird. Um, that was pretty straightforward, actually. Kind of disappointed. Kind of disappointed. I mean, we've had some gems so far, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jeez. <laughs> you never usually see more than, like, one of them. I mean, I know, like, the, the slime dungeon, there were hundreds of them, but... Oh, we're getting kind of low there. Well, good thing we've got Trixie's secret potion handy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm not a fool. I'm going to check. See if I'm going to miss... No. Okay, I am a fool. <sighs> I've been played the fool once again. Not that it's anything new, but... It'd be nice, once in a while, to just be like, Ha! Huh, hey, I guessed exactly where that secret seashell was gonna be. But no. No. Be asking a little too much. I am gonna get all the secret seashells, by the way. Even if I have to look up a guide. Because I want what's coming to me for those. I will be getting everything that I can. Even if at the very end I have to look up a guide. It may not be in the main playthrough. But it will happen. You just might have to wait a little while. Well, not doing so hot. And it's going to be annoying sounding for a few seconds. Maybe if one of these slimes kills me. Well, nothing doing. 
you know, let's 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 dig a little. Maybe there'll be something. <laughs> Maybe somebody left their heart in the sand. Although I don't know what I would want with a dirty heart. Ah, there we go. No more annoying beeping. For now. <laughs> I I am not so naive that I don't believe it'll happen again, but for now. Ah, perfect! A fairy! Exactly what we needed. Close your eyes and relax. Ah, oh, just let... Let me fill you with all these plundered hearts. Don't bother worrying where they're from. Just enjoy. I don't know why I'm not expecting these slimes anymore. They're popping up everywhere. But whatever. Whatever. Ooh. What's the... Mm. I'm trying to figure out what the point is of that room besides just being another one filled with enemies. Ah, hello! Do we have the eagle's key? I don't think we do. Let's see. Huh? A keyhole here? It says bird keyhole. Well, that's just dumb. Oops. Oh. Well, that's actually kind of convenient. I thought we were going to die for sure. I'm just checking to see if there's a mermaid necklace in here. Because knowing the Game Boy Zeldas, I know they were developed by different people now. I know one was Nintendo, I know one was Capcom. Two were Capcom. But knowing just the way they've been designed, it would be my luck to have it just be there and miss it. Well, <clears throat> since we're here, we've got a few rupees in the bank. How about we try a little, uh... How about we try... Whoa, careful there, Link. You almost bought the farm, and by bought the farm, it meant lo I mean lost the shield. And then we have to buy a brand new one. And I can't be affording that kind of expense at this point. You gotta take care of your stuff. Let's try a little river rafting. Just a nice, relaxing trip down the river. Uh, uh, actually, I don't know what the river's called, but whatever it is. Want to go on a raft ride for 100 rupees? Sure, why not? I already got the bow and arrow. Enjoy! I will try. I'm going to screw this up royally, aren't I? Whoa, okay, never mind. I was expecting this was gonna, like, just sweep me down the river, but I can just go as I want to. That's pretty nice. Can I, no, I can't go on the rocks. Oh well. Oh, hello. Do I want to go down there? can't tell. Okay, I want to go down one way or the other, and I guess I'm going this way. Well then. <laughs> Whoa, hello. No, I want the thing. I want the rupees. I want to make back my investment. No, I'm so close. Oh. I love that music, though. It's fantastic. There we go. Mates back some. Oh, no. I'm the worst at this mini game. Oh, I missed all. No, come on. No. This is worse than Rocket's Hideout. No! <laughs> Why am I doing this like this? Oh, I'm just missing all the rupees. Okay, up here. No, get... No! Link! Link, this is not how you ride down a river ride. No! <laughs> I'm so close. Oh. <laughs> so it pretty much is gan... <gasps> it pretty much is gambling at a point. Oh, I can't even get in there. Never mind. There we go. Made back something. Oh. There we go. Oh, there would have been something down there, wouldn't there? Oh. 
Oh, I'm gonna... Get back. Oh, there we go. Made back another thing, at least. Well, that was a bunch of money wasted. Um... Can we keep the raft? Can we just bring it back up? Try again? I doubt it. Um, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna see if no, no. Okay, never mind. There, there's really no point to. There's no point to continuing on. I see how it is. I just uh, might as well just quit now. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Showed me just how bad I am at this game. I should have expected no less, though. Get whatever. I knew... I, I had an idea where the things were gonna be, but... Well, anyway, it brought us where we need to go. Remember this place? I do, but I don't remember what it's called. The Face Shrine! With all your face needs. Whoa! Get faces for a bargain here. Anyway, last we were here, there was a, uh, I don't even know what the guy, the guy's called. There was a, I think he's just called a, the boss Armos or whatever. There was a boss in the very first room that, um, if you'll remember from Link to the Past, which I've never let's play, but I mean, who hasn't played that game at this point? Um, if you'll remember from Link to the Past, he is... I think the first boss, and you have to fight him by using arrows. Well, actually, him and six of his identical twins are the first boss. I think it's the first boss. I might be wrong. Don't quote me on that. Don't quote me on every anything. God, you, those of you who watch my videos, you should know. Never quote me. It's a terrible idea. You're just gonna get into like a whole heap of trouble if you do that. We're almost there. Didn't take... Oh, hello. I could just glitch through that. Okay. Fine with that. Can I do it? No, I can't do it with that guy. Okay. I hate them. I hate Armos. I hate Armos. I don't th even think you can kill these guys with a sword. Oh, well. Um... Arrows! Yay! Arrows! Yay! Now, fortunately, if he is anything like his brethren, he's a super... E oh... Is it super easy, boss? Okay, there we go. Oh. Just... Whoa, okay. I did have to use the potion. But yeah, pretty much just keep hitting him with arrows. Easy stuff right here. Whoa, hello. That's kind of getting gruesome right there. And what do we got here? You've got the face key. Uh, okay. Oh. What's this? Oh. To the finder. The Isle of Koholint is but an illusion. Human. Monster. Sea. Sky. A scene on the lid of a sleeper's eye. Awake the dreamer, and Koholint will vanish, much like a bubble on a needle. Cast away. You should know the truth. What? Illusion? What do you mean, illusioning? No, I, like, I couldn't, I would never have guessed that Link's Awakening would be a literal title. Yeah, it's a dream. I, I knew that. I mean, come on, it's... Not like this game is new. <laughs> um... Oh, hello, Mr. Owl. How many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? Hood, I see you have read the relief. While it does say the island is but a dream of the windfish, 
no one is really sure. Just as you cannot know if a chest holds treasure unless you open it. You goddamn right. And those ones that hold slimes, they're fantastic. So you cannot tell it if this is a dream until you awaken. The only one who knows for sure is the windfish. Trust your feelings. Someday you will know for sure. Someday I'm going to find out. In a few days. Just a sec. Sorry. I guess I'd feel a little sick. <laughs> can I kill these guys with arrows? I can. I'm an idiot. Why don't you, why don't you, I've got so many arrows, too. 60 arrows. Let's just, let's just get out of here. Get out of here. I'm an idiot. I'm a goddamn idiot. But what else is new? <laughs> Yay, a piece of power. Never gonna use my sword with it. What was that? <laughs> and they give you arrows too. Nice. I'm just gonna abuse my my uh, sudden influx of arrows right now. Is there anything I've missed? No, I got you. I got you. Just making sure there's nothing else I missed. Now that I know how to kill these guys. Uh, let's get the sword out so I'm not wasting all my arrows, how about? Um, so we get the face key. That helps us, I guess? Where we use the face key? Um, hmm. We need the bird or the eagle key for up north in uh, the mountains. And that's honestly all I know for other dungeons that we have left. Wait a minute. Unless there's something up here. Did, did I miss something up there? I might have. And what's up here? Telephone... Tele... Telephone booth? Oh, because... Yeah. Elrira. <laughs> Old man Elrira. Old man Jenkins! And I would have gone away with it, too weren't for you nosy kids and your dumb owl. Okay, so there's nothing else left here. Okay, so we can we can just go see if we can find the where the face key goes, I guess. I'm assuming it's got to be somewhere up here. Because it says this is still part of the face. Oh, hello. Did I talk to you? The windfish slumbers long, the hero's life gone. So are we still growing older as uh, we go through here? I don't know. Um, it's reminding me a bit of... Uh, there's an old Star Trek episode where... Uh, oh! Maybe we got to use it down here. Ooh. There are two shrines, one to the north, the other to the south. First, head south, where ancient ruins speak of the windfish. You will learn much there. Yeah, we did that already. Thank you. No, it's kind of reminding me a bit of, uh, there's a, uh, not entirely like it, but there's an old Star Trek episode where they go to this planet. It's like, why aren't these people dying from these radiation rays that should be killing them? And it's like, well, actually, they've got this plant that they're... Con they, they're consuming the spores or whatever. They're coated with the spores, and that's what's keeping them alive. But it ends ends up ter ter sending them into, like... <laughs> not a, uh... Not a, uh... Reefer Madness sort of high, but just, like, the, the 60s, 70s sort of, like, everybody loves everybody, man, kind of high. <laughs> and they have a perfect utopia. 
But nothing gets accomplished, and they have just spent the four, last four years being completely self-sufficient, but not actually doing anything of any note. So, sorry, just the kind of vibe I was getting from it for a second. Anyway, and do we have to come down? Ooh, wasn't there a place we couldn't get by down here, actually? Oh god, I'm, I'm terrible with these guys. Let's just, let's just sneak by. Yes, 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 yes. We couldn't get past here without the hook shot. I remember now, because it's right in front of me, and I'm not blind. Aha, aha, that looks like a face. Huh? Huh? I'll just stick it in my own gob and turn it. Right? <laughs> that, however, does not look like a face. I am extremely disappointed. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to see you guys next time on Let's Blindly Play The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening with Mioix Fu. And we're going to take on level 6, the Face Shrine. See you guys next time. Bye now.